Hi guys and welcome to the next Zero Waste Life with you. Yes, it's still me. Um, I cut my hair yesterday and I'm uh, not really satisfied now. Yesterday was better. But anyway, it will grow. So the problem of the plastic pollution effect us all. Um, we all are somehow guilty on that and um, as you probably know there's so much plastic in the oceans like it can never go back and all the animals living there are eating plastic because they mistaken it for uh, for for their food and I think that is horrible. Wildlife um, is already in a danger because of climate changing and um, I think that the animals don't need to be burdened uh, by another plastic problem and I think that it needs to be done something like as soon as possible immediately and that's why you should talk to your friends, to your family, to your colleagues, to your workmates um, about the problem and tell them how they can reduce the amount of the plastic of their everyday life by recommending them um, all the things that you do in your everyday life. Zero waste life is much much easier than they think. And we all share responsibility as individuals and also collectively. As individuals, um, we can change our behavior, limit our use and uh, help reduce the amount of the plastic. As collective, we can achieve much, much more and I think that it's really, really important that we work together as a team, as a community, because we can achieve a lot more if we work together, um, if we have a vision and if we have a mission and we see our goals. And in this video I want to be um, talking about four simple and easy items that you can uh, use as alternatives for uh, plastic. So um, I will mention some products and I will put all the links down in description below so you can check it out. These are, these are all the products that I recommend to everyone that I know and uh, yeah. Plastic cups and plastic lids. You can simply replace them with glass or jars which are perfect for homemade smoothies um, but also for transporting um, dry food for example or when you buy um, at the bulk stores. For example you can also store um, jams and jellies and sauces in the refrigerator and you can store them for a um, couple of weeks. Glass and jars are um, dishwasher safe and you can reuse them again. Plastic straws. Um, straws became a um, luxury product for us because we don't really, we don't need to drink with straws. But if you like to drink with straws, I will recommend you um, stainless steel straws bamboo straws or silicon straws. For me, I also like to drink with straws sometimes, but I make sure that, uh, that I refuse straws that they offer me at stores with the drinks and I always have my alternatives by hand. Stainless straws No, you can't see it. And um, bamboo straws. Yes, and they are really um, easy to wash. You can carry them with you when you're on the go. 
and they are also dishwasher safe so you can reuse them again plastic bags well everywhere we go they offer us plastic bags and that's why we zero waster came with alternatives please use reusable bags like for example canvas bags or cotton bags or um, tote bags mm, or you can also make your own homemade bags from old clothes um, for example you don't use anymore or you don't really want to donate you can use them for shopping for food that you buy at your grocery stores or when you go bulk buy you can <coughs> sorry you can put um, grains um, pasta or rice in them um, another thing when you buy uh, fruits or vegetables I have another alternative and these are these um, bags yeah they are very light in weight and you can put your fruits and veggies there weight your fruit or veggies or anything you want to buy unpacked then you put the etiquette on the back and put the fruit and veggies in your bag and you're perfect in a zero waste carry them home so you don't need to take a plastic bag with you they are very easy to wash and you can reuse them again please do not bring a plastic bag home make sure you always have your reusable bag with you by the hand when you go shopping Another item is plastic bottle and we who live in developed countries have, are privileged to drink water at our home everywhere we go. There are also countries that are not so privileged to drink water, to, save, mm, to drink safe water um, at their places. So they need to buy uh, water at their grocery stores. We don't need to buy water in the plastic bottles. Please do not buy water or juices in plastic bottles. Make sure you have your own refill bottle so you can refill it with the water everywhere you go. Or there are many another alternatives like for example I have this jar which I fill it with my favorite smoothie or with my favorite juice when I am on the go so I don't need to buy a plastic bottle. If you are more of um, on the go coffee or tea drinker uh, make sure that you won't buy a plastic cup instead of that um, have always your refill coffee cup with you or make a tea or coffee at home and take it with you when you're on the go are easy to wash and you can use them again so these were my four items of course there are a lot lot more but i just wanted to share with you um the easiest way how you can start a zero waste life because these four items are very important to avoid to refuse plastic in your everyday life. For my conclusion, I want to say that you should stop using single-use plastic. You should refuse and reject every time they offer you plastic bottle, plastic straws or plastic bag. Please make sure that um, before you go and buy a new stuff, Look in your cupboards, look in your wardrobe, go downstairs to your basement. Please look if you have old glasses or jars because I'm sure you might have some. Um, don't buy a new stuff, just use and reuse the old stuff that you have already at home. Don't buy a new stuff because it's already a waste. 
um, use materials that are um, reusable and recyclable. As I said at the beginning, we are much, much stronger if we work as a team, we work for a team and we follow the same mission. I know that it is impossible to avoid plastic in our everyday life, like from one day to another. But on the other side, I think that mm, it is already a big impact if we um, start with baby steps. I don't want to be preaching or something, um, I just want to educate you and share my thoughts, my actions with you so we can avoid plastic. I also want to let the people know that we have the problem that needs to be solved and, uh, and the best that we can do is minimize plastic and use reusable things and materials and follow the zero waste life. Reuse, refuse, reduce and recycle. I hope you liked the video. I will be very glad if you guys let me know what you think. What are your experience? And um, share your thoughts with me. Um, I hope I will see you at the next video. For more videos, please don't forget to subscribe. And till then, I wish you an awesome day. Bye.